Multiple White House aides resigned Wednesday in the aftermath of violent riots at the Capitol involving supporters of President Trump Donald Trump Trump acknowledges end of presidency after Congress certifies Biden win Congress affirms Biden win after rioters terrorize Capitol Third House lawmaker tests positive for COVID-19 this week more, with additional departures expected in the coming days. Stephanie Grisham Stephanie Grisham White House aides head for exits after chaos at Capitol Top Melania Trump aide Stephanie Grisham resigns Trump selects Hicks, Bondi, Grenell and other allies for positions more. The chief of staff to First Lady Melania Trump Melania Trump White House aides head for exits after chaos at Capitol Top Melania Trump aide Stephanie Grisham resigns Giuliani, Trump Jr. among guests at Mar-a-Lago New Year's party ditched by Trump. Report Moore and former White House Press Secretary, was the first announced her resignation. Deputy Press Secretary Sarah Matthews resigned a short time later, as did White House Social Secretary Ricky Nista, a White House official confirmed. Bloomberg News reported early Thursday morning that Deputy National Security Advisor Matthew Pottinger had stepped down as well. I was honored to serve in the Trump administration and proud of the policies we enacted. As someone who worked in the halls of Congress I was deeply disturbed by what I saw today, Matthews said in a statement. I'll be stepping down from my role, effective immediately. Our nation needs a peaceful transfer of power. Grisham's statement did not specifically mention the violence on Wednesday, but she was reportedly moved to step down because of the events at the Capitol. Additional aides are reportedly considering resigning, including National Security Advisor Robert O'Brien Robert O'Brien Trump administration rolls out plan to secure maritime sector against cyber threats Binman says he doesn't regret testimony against Trump White House advisors preparing to launch nonprofit to promote Trump policies. Report more, who broke with Trump earlier in the day by tweeting his support for Vice President Pence stating that he could not unilaterally reject electors for President-elect Joe Biden Joe Biden Trump acknowledges and of presidency after Congress certifies Biden win Congress affirms Biden win after rioters terrorize Capitol Here's how newspaper front pages across the world looked after mobs stormed the Capitol more. NBC News reported Transportation Secretary Elaine Chow Elaine Chow White House aides head for exits after chaos at Capitol Trump selects Hicks, Bondi, Grenell and other allies for positions Trump to name Giuliani's son to role on Holocaust Memorial Council more is also considering resigning.